eternal and I'm a polywag and I love burritos. Just kidding, I look algae. And this is a story about me. Spending his day swimming away between the lily pad and log. But when he woke up that day, he felt a little strange. He'd grown before, but this was something more. Suddenly he felt like he was changing. Yeah. And he'd never be the same. No, this was a metamorphosis. I'm okay with this. My biologist says. It's just a natural process of change. It seemed like out of nowhere, arms and legs were appearing. Slowly but surely it was becoming clear his gills and tail were disappearing. Now some folks might complain about a midlife crisis. But if they think that is strange, well, then they should try this. He was changing, yeah. He never be the same, no. This was his metamorphosis. I'm okay with this. My biologist says it's just, just a natural process of change. Have you ever talked to butterflies? The transformation can be amazing, but also pretty perplexing. They curl up into a chrysalis one night, and wake up with a brand new set of eyes and legs and... Imagine that. That'd be pretty cool. And for those of you out there who might find yourselves in situations where change is all around you, I have some advice. I got this advice from a couple of butterflies and a toad. They said it's important to try and keep your head even when it is difficult to hold on to your tail. And if you're feeling overwhelmed and you think that it's difficult to adapt, remember that there is a part of you, the part of you that knows right from wrong. That's the part to listen to. And the good news is that no matter what happens, that part will always remain. Which is a comforting thought, don't you think? Especially with all of this. Changing, yeah. We may never be the same, no. This is a metamorphosis. We're okay with this. Anthropologists say it's just a natural process of change, yeah. <laughs> Ribbit. Hooray! I'm a frog! <laughs>